Leo, I don't know why your reading just cut off like that. But I really feel like, listen, there's this has to come out. And the devil is busy. They do whatever they got to do so you don't hear the truth, okay? But what this is telling me is that God is wanting you to move forward. I left off in that last reading. You you were stuck. You can't continue to stay here, okay? Um, maybe you're needing to tap into that water. That water represents love and emotions. Maybe you need to tap into that and get out of your head. These swords represent mental energy. You're thinking too much. Step into that emotion. Because if you don't, I tell everybody, you have to do things from a heart space. If you do things from a heart space, one, you're being true and authentic to yourself. Two, whatever you, when, when you do it from your heart, you always have a successful outcome. But when you do shit from your head, you get energy like this. Because like I said, somebody was throwing that wand around not thinking about uh, the consequences of doing that. And now in regret because of what they've done. But it's not, this is not for you to beat yourself up. This is part of your soul's journey. You have to grow through this, okay? But you cannot sit still, right? Because you're destined to move forward. The two of wands is out here twice. Spirit just wanted you to turn your back to the bullshit and move forward so that you can create a brand new life for you, okay? You may have a, a twin flame, but if not, something stable and solid wants to come in. Ten of Pentacles, four of wands, okay? I mean, you got the sun out here. This is happiness and abundance. And nine of cups, which is fulfilled. After some healing. After some healing and getting in alignment. The star talks about universal alignment. How do you get in alignment for the assignment? You have to release anything that is not serving your highest good. Period. Family, friends, kids, lovers, jobs. If you've outgrown a situation or made some mistakes, whatever the fuck it is, don't sit here and keep beating yourself up about it. Free yourself, right? Release the negative energy. Because like I said, somebody really chose a cup that had a snake in it. This cup that you chose was not full of love and emotion. It could have presented itself to be that, but it wasn't. But I do see someone who's going within themselves, okay, for a pinnacle. And that, that's good because that's what's going to allow you to heal and also hear the Most High God when they're talking to you. Because this Leo, not only are you destined to be seen with all the sun shining on you, but you're destined to be um, to have forward movement. Two of Wands is out here twice. Two of Wands is out here twice. Four of Wands, Nine of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. Like I said, I feel like a, a new love, either you're bringing a love offer or someone else is going to bring you a love offer. And this is the outcome. Okay? But Leo's needing to take a little bit of time to themselves. Okay? So what else, Spirit? What else is going on with the Leo? <laughs> Remember, you are perfect, loved, and whole. You have to first accept yourself. I mean, maybe you didn't accept yourself for who you was in the beginning, and that's the reason you was giving this wand to everybody. Or maybe that was the reason, you know, if you weren't coming from a heart space, looking at the material things, it's possibly why you chose this wrong cup. Because once you really go within yourself like you're doing now, I see you doing this now, holding back, right? Holding your energy back. Whereas before, like I said, it was just going, you just giving it away. Um, you're going to go within yourself <clears throat> and you're going to realize after being burdened, after going through some shit, because tens talks about an ending. But after going through some shit with this situation, this cup that you chose, okay? You're going to realize that you are perfect. You are loved and you are whole. And so not everybody's worthy of your energy. And then when you get in that, that's like the magician. Then you start to manifest what you really know you deserve. And that's what I see. Wish is coming true. Wish is coming true. Okay, Leo? So let's not... There, there could have possibly been an ending. Like I just said, with that 10 right there, there's another 10. If it hasn't ended, it will end. And you need to allow it to end because this person is backstabbing you, betraying you. Or you could be doing this to someone. Take this as it resonates, okay? So let's see what else is going on. Yep, you got to get in balance. You have to get in balance. But the only way to get in balance is to come up out your head and touch some of them feelings. We got to feel it so we can heal it, okay? We have to grow through these situations. All right? Yes, will of fortune. Listen, the, the ball is in your court. Like I said, you are destined for forward movement. The wheel is in your court and it's moving forward. This wheel of fortune also speaks of good luck energies, that Jupiter energy. So that's also 
the uh, Sagittarius energy, but it's good luck. And I see that out here. Ten of Pentacles, Four of Wands, with the Sun, Star, and Nine of Cups. This is what you're destined for. <clears throat> but as long as you sit in this Five of Cups energy, Five of Cups is regret. But that's about to change, too. Fives talks about change. You have Five of Swords, Five of Cups. Shit's about to change. You're about to come up out of that energy and get justice. Speak your truth, but you must learn your truth first. And what is your truth, Leo? That you are perfect, loved, and whole. That's your truth, okay? What else is going on, spirit? Yes, and then had a brand new, passionate beginning. Because I said, there's a love offer coming in. Either coming in or going out. But it, it, it it's destined, okay? What else, spirit? I hate that y'all uh, video got, and that's the judgment. Judgment and what? You could be watching somebody or somebody could be watching you that's wanting to have this brand new passionate beginning. But with judgment and justice out here, judgment is a karmic lesson, okay, for me as an intuitive reader. And I feel like you you learned that karmic lesson with that snake. The cup of love that you chose out of these options, it was your karmic lesson. This was not done by accident. This was done on purpose. So that you could grow through these situations and now learn your truth. And like I said, that's your truth. You're perfect love and whole. And so now you know what it is you need to invest in and what you don't. Because the Leo know that not everybody's worthy of their energy. Look at all that energy. You can't just get at the end and everybody. We have to be selective in the things that we do. But justice and judgment out here is telling me that Leo has learned a very valuable lesson. And is ready for forward movement. Unstoppable forward movement. This is destiny. Okay? Two of ones out here twice. All right, so let's look at career. Let's look at career, okay? Stand in your strength. Stand in your strength, Leo. You're going to be all right. Spirit, what's coming up uh, next 30 days for career for my Leo? Two of Wands. Now, just what in the fuck? I will tell you this right out the gate, okay? And then we got to start again, okay? You're going to have to heal because, and a lot of people don't know this, Okay, they they wonder why they had a bad relationship, <clears throat> and they they, they they money start fucking up. Listen, first of all, we shouldn't have any unhealthy attachments to anything, right? Um, but I don't know what the hell that was. I just heard. But if you're holding on to some kind of resentment with this regret and the five of swords, if you're holding on to that, listen, resentment blocks the flow of love. Everything is energy, because I see an, it, something's being blocked. So, in the next 30 days, your money could be blocked. Because Spirit is saying that you're needing to heal. Yes. Come from, listen, heart space. King of Cups. The King of Cups is very um, emotionally mature. They know exactly how they feel. Like I said over here, you're needing to touch that water, that emotions. That's what the King of Cups is. Okay? In all of these cards, there's nothing but water. Okay? Someone needs to get out of their head, touch their emotions, Feel it so you can heal it and unblock yourself, okay? Put an end to it. Transform. And then stand in your truth like the King of Swords do because if you don't, you're going to create a fucking burden and your money going to be fucked up. Five of Pentacles, right? Because what Spirit wants to bring in for you is the Ten of Pentacles. Pentacles is money. It's ultimate achievement. If you don't heal yourself with that star, like I said, it's going to create a burden. You're going to have half of what you got now. You're going to be left out in the cold financially. Right? This is what Leo need to be. Financially stable, looking good, smelling good, money good, wish your bitch would. This is where you need to be. And in order for you to get there, you're going to have to heal. You cannot beat yourself up because of either what you did or what was done to you. Everything happens in our life for a reason. And your reason was to learn your fucking truth. What is your truth? You are perfect, loved, and whole. And not everybody deserves your energy. That's your motherfucking truth that you're going to have to go within and figure that shit out, else you're never going to be happy in any relationship or any aspect of your life, okay? So let's get, let's do that. Let's move forward so we can have some brand new beginnings. There could be some apologies coming in for you or some, or you could be needing to apologize to someone about this pain, but I feel like once you do that or once this person comes in to do that, balance, healing, wow, this is what really, look at this shit right here, man. Oh, my God, Leo, baby, holy fucking shit. Wait a minute, y'all, because I can't, okay? I can't. This is too fucking much, but it's real. Nine of Cups out here again. 
twin flame connection very deep soul connection is what wants to come in for you after you heal from the bullshit that you went through wishes fulfilled a high level of commitment ace of fucking cups with the two of cups the most high god said that's your justice after you balance yourself out get yourself in alignment for the assignment okay Re release any resentment that you got okay and if this is you that done something to somebody you got to forgive yourself you got to you can't beat yourself up or else you're gonna stay stuck and stagnant and like i said if you continue to stay stuck and stagnant boom they go to the tower it's gonna make you reevaluate anyway. So come up out your head. Come up out your head, Leo. And get in that goddamn chariot and get ready to conquer life. Get ready to conquer life. Stop lying to yourself. Stop it. Stop lying to yourself, okay? Because the most high God wanna bless you. Spirit is saying you got to get in that full energy. There you go again, son. I can't make this shit up, okay, Leo? Whew, that's what I have for you. It's your girl, Spiritual Sag. If you need a personal reading, all of that information will be in the description box. Baby, you can do this, okay? I feel like this, this Leo needs a spiritual bag. You need to you need to cleanse your energetic field because, you you know what I'm saying, you got some extra shit going on. But forward movement is what's trying to come for you. But you got some extra shit going on in your energetic field that you need to cleanse, okay? If you need one, you can't find one nowhere else, you need to go to my Etsy shop and get yourself one. Cut that bitch open, pour it in your bath water, sit in that thing for 30 minutes. And while you're sitting in there, release all your negative energy and ask Archangel Michael to come in and protect you. Place a seal of protection around you as you move through this situation in your life. But you're destined for the best outcome possible with the sun, happiness, and abundance, okay? That's what I have, Leo. It's your girl, Spiritual Sage. Until next time, mm, bye.